हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल फ्रेंड्स टुडे वी विल डिस्कस हाउ टू क्रिएट डोमेन कंट्रोलर ऑन विंडोज सर्वर 2022 और हाउ हाउ वी कैन इंस्टॉल एक्टिव डायरेक्टरी ऑन विंडोज सर्वर 2022 फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वी विल ओपन सर्वर मैनेजर डैशबोर्ड हियर वी सी ऑल दी सर्विसेज व्हिच आर रनिंग और व्हिच आर इशूज आई मीन दी दिस इज दी मेन सर्वर dashboard here we can see all types of errors warnings and other things and we can uh, remove these errors and such type of things like if any service is blocked then we uh, yeah stop we can restart and we can uh, fix the issues uh, to uh, go ahead we have to here are different options like add and remove uh, feature remove role and feature add server creating server group and server uh, manager uh, properties these are the options uh, but we will click on add uh, remove uh, features wizard before uh, you begin uh, we have to read the different uh, instruction carefully and after that we have to uh, click on next and here are uh, two features server role based features installation or remote desktop feature we select role based feature installation and then here is select a server from the wizard we will select uh, the server uh, which are shown below then next here are different features are available which uh, are which we can install Uh, for active directory installation we will select active directory e domain services when we click then it gives a message add some feature after that uh, we will uh, click on next for installation this feature as soon as we click on active directory domain controller all its related services are automatically uh, installed no feature installation is in progress this will take some time in this feature remote server administration active directory light uh, domain services tool active directory module for uh, windows power shell and active directory administrative center and some other features are installing with active directory domain computers this will is uh, shortly completed this will not take much time friends one one thing have to note uh, when we want to create domain controller or we want to install active directory the services on uh, windows server 2022 we must have to give an i dedicated uh, static ip address on uh, lan and this lan connect with some other pc or some network features are uh, completed successfully now we will click on uh, promote the server as a domain controller friends here are different options select the deployment operation here are different option add a domain controller to existing domain I, it means we have already a domain controller and we want to make an additional domain controller or uh, and uh, add uh, add a new domain server second one as a domain to an existing forest third one as a new forest these are the option we click on add a new forest installation and give the domain name and because we are going to uh, fresh uh, domain controller we do not want to create an existing domain controller here are different options uh, forest um, function level uh, i select windows server 2016 we can also select 20 Two twenty two two thousand eight or two thousand twelve. Here are different option. Here specify domain control capabilities, domain name servers, and global catalog. We must uh, select these option. Otherwise, we will not able to create domain controller. 
here we have to give password type the directory service restore module and this password will be the main password after creation of domain controller we will give this password when our domain controller uh, will be installed it dns also uh, may be selected uh, with this domain it's working the and searching net bios domain name as soon as it find out the net bios domain name we, we click on next here friends uh, it specify the location of adds database log files and sys4 folder these are the main folder of Active Directory users, log files and some database, Active Directory related database. We can also uh, change the their path but it is recommended to set the default path. Click on next. Here these are the settings in which we done in previous steps. This is summary of the operation which we have done in previous steps now we click on uh, next and it's this is the prerequisite check uh, process all prerequisite checks passed successfully click install to begin installation it means our server is ready for installation our prerequisite are completely okay we click on install and our Active Directory domain services are uh, installation is in progress. This will take some time. it's completed click on ok close feature installation is completely successful now after restart server is ready and we could we have see these options like add remove features and click next active directory users and computers here we see computers domain controllers forest uh, foreign security principles and uh, default users and groups these are built-in users and groups which are automatically created uh, during domain controller or active directory installation services now our domain controller is ready and these are the server administrator tool and friend DNS is also installed with this uh, domain controller all are okay uh, done successfully if you have any problem please write in comments bye